Are you guys tired of Vegas Pro crashing on you? No matter which version you have, Vegas Pro 18, Vegas Pro 17, Vegas Pro 16, 15, 14, it doesn't matter. You can apply these tricks on every version that you have to reduce it as much as possible, the crashes, the freezes while you're editing, while you're rendering. So let's start reducing these crashes right after the intro. What's up guys, my name is Alex. Welcome back to this brand new video. Now, if you're new here for the first time, make sure you consider subscribing down below for more tutorials about video editing, how to grow on YouTube, and all these kinds of videos you can expect on the channel. Today, I'm gonna show you guys a couple tricks you guys can implement into your Vegas Pro version to reduce the crashes. Because of course, you know, getting rid of the crashes and the freezes entirely, that's not possible because everybody that's watching this video has different computers, has different specs, they're like the different strongness of their device and systems. Reducing it completely is not possible possible because of course any other software such as Premiere Pro and After Effects they can crash too. So don't worry guys you're not the only one that experienced these kinds of crashes so let's get started right now. All right so the first method I'm going to show you to prevent Vegas Pro from crashing and freezing is importing your footage a different way. So a lot of people will actually shoot their video they will transfer the clips from their camera you know SD card into a folder on their computer and they will drag all the footage from that folder directly into Vegas Pro just drag and drop but that's the bad thing. If you're going to to import like a lot a lot of footage that's really really heavy for example 1080p 60 fps or even 4k or even 8k what you need to do is you need to go ahead and click on this explorer tab right here and then you can go into the folder that way for example in your documents and then you can click on black magic design for example you can open up that folder and then all your files will be here and you will be able to drag them into vegas pro 18 pretty simple and it's going to prevent it because of course if you're going to drag and drop it a lot lot of crashes might occur so that's the first trick just go into the explorer tab right here pick the appropriate folder and then you can just drag in your clips that way and that can also prevent the crashes okay so the second method is actually pretty pretty straightforward so we're gonna go to options at the very top and we're going to hit preferences and then we're gonna go to the video tab which is right here the gpu acceleration of video processing is standard going to be set to optimal nvidia corporation geforce rdx 2070 but you want to select off right here and then you want to click on apply now of course you need to restart vegas in order for these changes to take effect and that's pretty much what you need to do secondly to prevent these crashes and the third one is actually pretty similar to the second one we're going to go back to preferences and then we're going to go back to the video tab once more and right here it says dynamic ram preview max the max available ram that i have right here is 32 gigabytes and it is set to 200 you want to also crank that up even more so let's say instead of 200 we're going to use for example half of our ram so we're going to type in 16,000. And then we're going to hit apply and we're going to hit OK. They will also prompt you this box like if this value is set too high, memory paging may decrease playback rate. So of course, if you're going to set this too high, you're going to use all your RAM for Vegas Pro and nothing else can run. For example, Photoshop on the background when you're making a thumbnail or browsers, you want to just leave a little bit more of RAM also available for other programs and processes. So then we're going to hit OK. So now we've set it to 16 gigabytes of RAM that Vegas can use out of the 32 that we have available. Then we're going to hit OK and and that is basically pretty much what you can do in order to prevent these crashes. Now, of course, you guys might also be wondering, what if my Vegas crashes while rendering? So to prevent crashes while rendering, we're going to go to File and we're going to hit Render As. And then, of course, different formats can also change it up. I always render out my videos in Sony AVC slash MVC. Then I just pick YouTube 60 FPS Render Template. But if it crashes on you, just try, for example, Windows Media Video. YouTube is going to accept these video formats anyway. You can also use for example the main concept mpeg 2 the panasonic p2 xd cam they're all mp4s so they all should work so if vegas pro gets stuck on a certain percentage while you're exporting just cancel the render save your project just in case and just try a different format and that should work just try different formats until you get across the percentage that vegas used to be get stuck on and that is basically how to do it these are four really simple tips you can implement into vegas pro to prevent it from crashing and freezing all right guys so that is it for this video that's all i have for you guys today now if this video went by too fast make sure to just pause it rewind it go back and you know follow all these steps i hope this will actually be helpful to you and that it will actually prevent these crashes of course and no matter which kind of version you use these tips count for every single version even like sony vegas like 13 and versions below that so if you guys enjoyed this video and if you find this video helpful make sure to reward it with a like down below thanks a lot for watching and i'll see you guys obviously in tomorrow's video